My name is Charles Sidney Hudson, and I'm 86 years old. So when you think about the life that you have lived over the last 86 years, what makes you excited? 86 years worth. <laughs> it's, uh, my life has been exciting all the way. I've had some ups and downs, but fortunately there's been more ups than there has downs. And, uh, and I thank the goodness for that. Uh, but I've enjoyed everything that I've ever done, I've enjoyed it. I never had a, a real set goal for anything I wanted to do, but I took advantage of opportunities that came up and I enjoyed all of it. And uh, I, uh, I had, had a, one bad knockdown, I lost a son. Uh, when he was 25 years old. And that was the worst thing that ever happened to me in 86 years. And uh, of course, I've lost family, but you, you, you realize that some of that's coming. But when you, your children are supposed to outlive you, and, uh, and that hurt. Uh, other than that, I was in construction for 19 years in City of Pearl for 17 and a half years, and County Supervisor for three and a half years. And, uh, and then I went back to construction. I, politics was too much. So when you think about grieving, how did you learn to process your emotions better? I didn't, I didn't learn anything. I had a strong faith in God. And and my son and I and me and his his mother had a great relationship with him for 25 years. And if we if if we had not had that good relationship, it would have been worse. But we had good memories, and with faith in God and the memories we had of our relationship with our son through his growing up years. It was bearable, but it's uh, something that we've thought about every day since then. And that's, that's it's tough. Uh, it's, it, like I said, our children are supposed to outlive us. And, uh, and that didn't happen, and it was the saddest day of my life, but uh, you have to keep going. And my motto has always been, keep smiling and driving straight ahead. And it's worked. So what's your game plan moving forward? And what would you, what <laughs> advice would you give to other people? <laughs> moving forward, I don't know. A lot of people say getting old is fun, but it's not. But I want to keep it going for a little while longer. And, and so I've still got some things that that I've got to do. Um, my wife is in a nursing home uh, in Brandon, and I'm here, and we still have a house in Pearl, and I'm still thankful that I've got mine enough that I can kind of see after my business. But my son is a great asset to me. He's living in my house right now and trying to take care of me and his mother. and. Uh, and that's a real blessing to us. And, and he's the only, only, we had two sons and he's the one, only one left. And he is, he is a great guy. And, uh, and I thank the good Lord for him and uh, for him trying to see after me. And, but I'm still planning to, to keep smiling and driving straight ahead because that's all I know.